What is a statement of claim? District court. What is a statement of claim and how to complete one? A statement of claim is a document prepared by the plaintiff, which is the creditor. That is the person or company who is initiating the case in the court. A statement of claim usually accompanies a writ or could be otherwise needed during the course of proceedings. The statement of claim states the nature and cause of the claim and the relief or remedy sought in the proceedings. How do I complete my statement of claim? Using headings can assist the reader to understand your claim. You should number each paragraph of your statement of claim. This makes it easier for you the defendant, and the judge to refer to a particular point. Each paragraph should follow logically from the one before and be in chronological date order. Chronological order is the order in which the events occurred from first to last. This is the easiest pattern to write and follow. Write your statement of claim using simple everyday language. What information should I include in my statement of claim? The statement of claim should start by identifying the parties to the dispute and their relationship to each other. Include any relevant background facts. Explain how and in what way the defendant or defendants has wronged you according to law. This is the legal basis for your claim. State the essential facts which support the claim being made. In the statement of claim with clear statements of the order that you want the court to make. What information should I leave out of my statement of claim? Limit your statement of claim to things which are relevant to your case. Do not include evidence. Evidence is presented at the trial to prove the essential facts referred to in your statement of claim. Leave out any detailed arguments about how the law applies to your case. You may have an opportunity to make these legal arguments called submissions at the hearing of your case. Put emotions about dispute aside by not including your opinion or sharing what you think has happened. Stick to the facts. Be aware, if you include inappropriate or irrelevant material in a statement of claim, the other party may apply to have that material struck out or removed. If the other party is successful in their application to have a part or all your claims struck out, the court may order you to pay their legal costs in bringing that applications. Even if you have successfully applied for a fee waiver in the proceedings, these legal costs will still be payable. I finished writing my statement of claim. What do I do next? You should have all relevant documents ready to file with the courts. Number one is going to be your cover sheet. Number two is going to be your summons. Number three is going to be your complaint. Number four is going to be your pleading. Number five, fee waiver, if you're indigent. Number six, certificate proof of service, if you're paying for your case. Number seven, fees if paying for your case. Go to your local court's clerk and file your documents. Guides to assist self-represented litigants work through all the steps involved in bringing a proceeding. These guides can be found in the representing yourself section of the court's websites. Should you require further information about court processes, please visit your local court website or call. Relief. State briefly and precisely what damages or other relief the plaintiff asks the court to order. Do not make legal argument. Legal includes any basis for claiming that the wrongs alleged are continuing at the present time. An argument is a statement or set of statements that you use in order to try to convince people that your opinion about something is correct. Include the amounts of any actual damages claimed for the acts alleged and the basis for these amounts.
include any punitive or exemplary damages claimed, the amounts and the reasons you claim you are entitled to actual punitive money damages. I'm only a guidepost. I will and cannot tell you how to fill out these documents. I have not sold any of this information and I don't ask for handouts. So don't get scammed, tribe. Read, apply, execute. Go to the source, law and government websites. So as always, I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.